Hey everyone, Sean here, and welcome to episode 9 of my quarantine-induced web series, Old T-Shirt Tuesday! So last time we traveled back to 1991. Well, this week, we're going to jump a couple years further back to the end of the summer of 1989. I was going to be heading off to New York City in the fall to begin attending the American Academy of Dramatic Arts. My friend Nancy who had been in two shows with me in our senior year in high school, um, The Crucible and How to Succeed in Business Without Really Trying, had just completed her sophomore year at the prestigious Brandeis University, where she was studying to become a marine biologist. Well, in the summer of 1989, as part of her studies, she interned with the Cape Ann Whale Watch. Cape Ann is a coastal area north of Boston, which includes the lovely cities of Rockport and Gloucester, among others. Well, I really enjoy whale watches, and I had intended to pop up there and visit Nancy, but suddenly the summer and her internship were coming to an end, and I hadn't gone up yet. Well, of course, there were no cell phones and no email back then, so I just drove up there to surprise her on what I think was the last day she was going to be there. Well, the surprise turned out to be on me. Nancy was there, but they had two boats, and she had just gone out on one of them right before I got there. Well, I didn't feel like just standing there for two hours waiting for her to come back, so I hopped on the other boat and went on a whale watch. Well, I spoke to the crew on board, and they radioed over to the other boat to let Nancy know I was there, so I'd at least see her when I got back. It was an incredible whale watch. We saw so many whales I lost count. The crew seemed genuinely thrilled and said it was actually the best show that even they had seen all summer. One of my favorite jokes involves whales. Some people think it's funny. Some people don't even get it. I think it's hilarious. I don't even remember who told this joke to me. I don't know whose joke it is, but here it goes. Two whales walk into a bar. One whale says to the other whale, That's it, that's the whole joke. Well, after a couple of hours, our boat came back to the dock and Nancy was there to greet me. All I can remember is that we hung out chatting at the dock for a while and at some point I bought this t-shirt. It's actually still a very comfortable shirt, albeit a bit thin from decades of wearing and washing. And I've always liked the way it fits. In 2005, I even wore it in a short film called Happy at Home which my friends Julia and Jeremy shot here in my apartment in LA. Well, after that summer of 1989, Nancy continued at Brandeis for two more years and got her degree. Uh, after that, she moved around a bit, building a career and a life for herself along the way, eventually settling on the amazing Oregon coast in the lovely town of Newport. I hadn't seen or spoken to her in a very long time, but thanks to Facebook, uh, I was able to reconnect with her about 10 years ago or so. Well, in the fall of 2016, my then-girlfriend, now wife, uh, and I decided to take a road trip from L.A. to Portland, Oregon. Uh, and we were going to get a one-way car rental and fly back. I got in touch with Nancy to let her know, and so we planned to make Newport our last stop on the trip before heading to Portland and then flying back to L.A. We got to stay in this cute and fun steamboat called the Newport Bell, which had been converted into a unique bed and breakfast. It was so fun seeing Nancy again, meeting her family, hanging out and getting caught up after all those years. Well, that wraps up this episode. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time.